The passing of the Chinese doctor who tried to sound the alarm about China's grave situation has sparked public anger and grief. Reports that Li Wenliang is no longer around after contracting the same illness he was treating his patients for in the city where the latest incident began. Last December, Li sent a text in a group chat with other physicians of a SARS-esque cousin. For his troubles, he was told by police to stop making false statements and was put under the magnifying glass for spreading rumors, aka telling people the truth. According to Forbes, after conflicting reports last Thursday, the Lee was no longer around, then critically ill, then indeed no longer around. Chinese citizens stormed onto social media voicing sorrow and extreme displeasure towards Xi and his pals. Li has become a hero to Chinese people for his attempts to warn the public about the crisis in the early days when the government was trying to cover it up. He was hospitalized January 12, 2020 and officially diagnosed with the you-know-what on February 1, 2020 before his passing was confirmed on February 6. According to the failing New York Times, hashtag we want freedom of speech had at least 2 million views and 5,500 posts before fun-loving Chinese censors completely wiped them out of existence. But in the meantime, China will continue to keep hush-hush at the expense of its citizens, all because saving face remains more important than saving actual lives. If you want more Tomo in your life, Click the subscribe and bell button so you get notified when a new video is up. Thanks for watching Tomo News.